Besides the button New to add a new item to a list and Quick Edit to create a list and edit a list, we also have a button to export to Excel. If I click this button, I'll be able to give a file a name, and that type of file is an I, IQY file, which is a Microsoft Excel web query file. So I'm just going to call it Suppliers List, and I'll click Save. As soon as I save it, I can see it's downloading in the lower left corner here. And if I was to click it, it would actually open up Excel, and it would open up that list of suppliers. And let me just bring this into view. What you can see here is it's automatically opened Excel, and it's opened up the list of suppliers, which is only two of them, and opened them into Excel. If I want to look at my data connection, what we can do is choose data from the ribbon and we can click the queries and connections button. This basically allows me to see that there is a connection. Let me just resize this window again. There is a connection here called suppliers list. And if I've added some more data to my SharePoint list, I may want to click this button and refresh the connection so that it brings through any new data into my Excel file. Another thing with um, exporting to Excel is on the Data tab you also have a Properties button. And if we click the Properties button, we can see that here there's a naturally a link. It allows us to click this button if we want to see the connection properties. And it will automatically refresh this connection on Refresh All. I can look around here for information about where the connection is. That's the IQY file there. And I can also look at things like it's using A1 to F3 currently in this um, sheet. And so there's some information here about the connection. And I can click Close. So you can export data from a SharePoint list to Excel and you can refresh that connection if you've added more data to the SharePoint list. I'm just going to close Excel.